वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी फायर फाइटर्स बैटल आउट ऑफ कंट्रोल वाइल्ड फायर्स इन द टेन स्पेन अराउंड 250 फायर फाइटर्स ऑन वेडनेसडे बैटल अ वाइल्ड फायर रेजिंग आउट ऑफ कंट्रोल ऑन स्पेन्स हॉलीडे आइलैंड ऑफ टेन एरिफ दैट फोर्स रोड क्लोजर्स एंड एवेक्शन ऑफ द फायर विलेजेस ऑफिशियस सेट The fire which broke out on Tuesday night was raging through the forested areas with the steep ravines in the northeastern part of the island part of the Canary Islands archipelago of the northwestern Africa Around 250 firefighters backed by the 13 planes and helicopters including 3 seen from the mainland Spain worked to contain the fire in an area difficult to reach The flames had so far burned about 1800 hectares. The villages of Arate, Chivisaya, Media Montana, Ajafona and Las Lagunetas were evacuated on Wednesday morning as the precaution because of the thick smoke. Local authorities have cut off roads leading to the mountains on the northeastern parts of the island. The wildfire comes after the Canary Islands were hit by a heat wave. that has left many areas tinder dry increasing the risk of wildfires heat waves have become more likely due to the climate change scientists said as global temperatures rise over the time heat waves are predicted to become more frequent and intense and their impacts more widespread spanish state meteorological agency has issued orange heavy storm warnings across the parts of the northwestern and southeastern aragon autonomous community and yellow warnings across the rest of the affected area officials could update and possibly extend the coverage of the weather alerts over the coming days sustained heavy rainfall could trigger flooding in the low lying communities near the rivers streams and creeks Urban flooding is also possible in the developed areas with the easily overwhelmed storm water drainage system. Sites downstream from the large reservoirs or rivers may be subject to flash flooding after relatively short periods of the intense rainfall. Landslides are possible in the hilly or mountainous areas especially where heavy rainfall has saturated the soil. authorities could issue mandatory evacuation orders for the flood prone communities over the coming days disruptions to electricity and telecommunication services are possible where the severe weather impacts utility networks the severe weather may contribute to transport disruption throughout affected regions flood water and debris flows may render some bridges rail networks or roadways impassable impacting overland travel in and around affected areas pounding on the road surface could cause hazardous driving conditions on the regional highways authorities could temporarily close some low lying routes that becomes inundated by the flood waters that's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news For more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates